Good afternoon. I'm Dave Percy at the National Weather Service with Sunday's Alaska statewide weather. Low pressure tracking northward across the Bering Strait to just west of Point Hope to Cape Lisburn this afternoon. Brought an area of strong southerly winds that gusted as high as 60 miles per hour at Cape Newenham, as well as Mountain Village with Golovin on the Seward Peninsula east of Nome seeing winds gusting to 53 miles per hour this afternoon with temperatures rising into the mid to upper 30s through the area. Snow continued to fall with a couple inches falling at Nome today and areas of blowing snow are noted along the western Arctic coast. Otherwise, rain fell in Kodiak and extended into Kamishak Bay with a mixture of light precipitation over Bristol Bay northward into the Kuskokwim Valley. For tonight, it'll stay variably cloudy across the southeast coast, but dry with light winds, and that'll hold over the eastern interior as well. A system edging its way northward toward Kodiak will spread increasing chances of rain northward along the Kenai Peninsula and into western Prince William Sound with uh, rain or rain and snow mixed from northeast Bristol Bay in across the Alaska Range and possibly the Kuskokwim Valley. Otherwise, look for uh, conditions to improve as high pressure starts to build in Monday in toward the Chukchi Sea, so there'll be some flurries on the central Arctic coast and periods of uh, light snow will continue from the Seward Peninsula across Selowick Valley into the Western Brooks Range, but amounts will be lighter and an Arctic front will produce an area of snow from the Tanana Valley southwestward into northeast Bristol Bay with a mixture of rain and snow for Kodiak Island, southern Kenai Peninsula, as well as the North Gulf Coast. And chances for rainfall increase on the northern coast of the Panhandle in the afternoon as well. That'll translate into a generally rainy, foggy day for the southeast coast, uh, but winds will remain light and precipitation amounts won't be very heavy at all. Arctic Front will continue a zone of light snow from the upper Tanana Valley and 40 Mile Country southwestward across the Kuskokwim Valley and then on out to the Yukon and Kuskokwim Delta and Nunavak Island. A front farther to the south will bring a chance of snow to the Pribilof Islands. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Dave Percy.